Hey guys, Smart Ninja 0 here. Today we're going to be doing this new map um, I made. It's called Warrior's Capture. It's made by me, as you can see. Um, and this map's really cool. It's a capture the flaggy type map. There's four different kits that you can choose. Um, now, uh, my only person who can help me right now who's not doing something abhorrent um, has been helping me a lot, so I'm only going to show off one kit, which is going to be the Thief. This gets a lot more, if it gets a lot of likes and good content and stuff, um, then we'll do more and we might even do it for a stream, because, yeah. Um, so you choose your kit by dropping it, and there's a bunch of different kits. Some are pretty overpowered, they all have a purpose. Uh, so for example, the Alchemist is really good for killing the flag, uh, the Thief is really good for getting to the flag, the Archer is really good for killing people as they go to the flag and the Warrior is just a balanced, good in general, I guess. Um, that was kind of my thing when I was making it. Anyways, we're going to start. So, this is going to be unedited so you can see all my PvP skills. And also so you can see exactly what a game's like. You'll notice on the side we have a nice scoreboard uh, with uh, some high-tech coloring. Um, so... So you're going to notice that there's beacons that do stuff. Um, uh, so this is, it's a little bit difficult to do uh, with one person on each team simply because then you um, won't get, uh, um, you don't have a lot of light. And then you'll notice you do keep your damage just so you, you can tell people I had X hearts left. I thought that um, I thought that was a cool idea. And you do regen. Uh, regeneration is different in this game, which you probably noticed. It's after you've been out of combat for a while. Um, uh, yeah, you got it. Um, you'll regen, which I think is cool. Um, it'll, you only get the regen effect if you're not at full health. It's a just a different thing. So it's the only way you really regen. There's a little timer and such. Um, and again, they're all really like cool kits and stuff. Um, now you will, you'll notice you can't actually jump with this, but if you do press, oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ah, uh, yeah. Um, if you do press uh, spacebar, you can go slightly, just a littlest bit faster. Um, and this is actually kind of funny because it, the uh, players don't take knockback, uh, but there's a little pit there, so if they accidentally fall in there for some reason, um, then they have to go up. They're not stuck, don't worry. I, th I thought about that, but I thought that might be a little bit too mean. Um, um, no, they can just go out. Now, he's going to get another point. You can also block in this, even though it's 1.13, you can see that by up here. Um, but you can block in this, you can attack. It's just generally pretty great. Um, and again, it's a little bit difficult to show off my uh, the other kits because I I'm only my one, and I'm not exactly sure what he is. I think I think he's probably warrior, but not sure. I, that looks like warrior. Um, spectators are automatically put into spectator mode. You can't start the game unless you have. A player on each team and there's none and yeah let's see if we can get one more game so I can show off a different kit all right so we'll do one more game um, this time I'm gonna go Archer so and again they all have different sneak abilities and stuff the reason I'm gonna show off Archer is because it's a little bit more special uh, simply because you'll notice I don't actually start with arrows. That's because I have to drop my weapon to get arrows. Um, so Archer is very overpowered unless they have it, simply because you can one shot the bow while you sneak. Now this is kind of hilarious. Uh, in a, in a normal game setting, it's not as overpowered as it seems. Um, but in, 1v1s, it definitely seems cool, pretty overpowered. Uh, you never really run out of arrows, so you don't have to worry about that. There is a limit to the number of arrows. Uh, it is 
Um, but yeah, if you're good with Archer, if you can aim good. So you'll notice he's blocking. So here's a great example. If I shoot him, it just bounces off. So I have to actually go in with my sword. You also notice that I don't get um, over the amount of arrows that I should have. You can try moving them, but I do have an anti for that. So it, it's definitely, it doesn't work well against the flag. So you have to be careful with it. If they get the flag, you want to shoot them before they get the flag or before they start blocking. That's the reason they have the shield. That and also so they can really tank. I forgot to drop. That's another thing about it. It's a little bit annoying to forget, but I thought that was a good thing. No, he knows. Ah. Uh, so yeah, um, and you can shoot the bow regularly too, um, but it, it's not as effective. And you can drop anything. You can even drop your armor if you want. Um, you'll notice that even though it's leather armor, it equivalates to uh, iron armor. And if you block, um... oh, I forgot a. No. Oh. No. Oh, so yeah, again, it might seem really overpowered at first. It might seem like I'm, but if it is pretty difficult to use, um, so you don't have to worry about it. And again, even it doesn't work well against the flag and other and every other, oh, I forgot to drop it, which is another thing. Um, in every other scenario, it might work great. Um, but it's hard with the flag cause all they have to do is just time it accordingly. <laughs> I'm gonna see if we can do. Maybe I'll get it through all the kits. Anyways, uh, I'm outroing. Oh, you can just leave too. Anyways, that's pretty much it, guys. If you enjoyed this, um, this is a map. You should be able to download it. Link in the description. You'll be sent to the Dropbox link for it. Uh, just click download and it will work. Uh, you just send me GG and Discord. <laughs> um, anyways. Yeah, again, it's a little bit hard to, it's it's really fun. Um, it's spam clicking 1.8, it is in 1.13. Uh, it does have a custom texture pack, which is automatically included when you load into the world. Um, so you don't have to worry about that. If you do open it to LAN and stuff, you will have to send it to people. If you have it on a server, obviously you'll have to use the server. I'm gonna see if I can get someone in else in here so I can show off the other two, uh, other two kits, which is the Knight and the Alchemist. Uh, but if not, I'm gonna call it here. Yeah, I don't have any friends, so um, we're not going to do that. Anyways, thanks again for watching. Feel free to download it. Um, leave a comment below. What do you think? Is the Archer 2 overpowered? Would you like to see me use the other kits? Um, anyways, that's pretty much it. Thanks again for watching, guys, and I'll see you in another one. Bye.